Hello. Greetings. Where are we up right now? All right, so really quickly, we are at Epcot, um, and we are here, and Sarah will link to the other video, but we are here for International Flower Garden Festival. We're going to make this quick, um, but we know a lot of people want, you know, a separate video on just Connections Cafe, so we are stopping over at... The newly opened Connections Cafe and Eateries, the full title. Yeah, there's two, the cafes, the Starbucks, and the Eateries, the quick service. Okay, awesome. And uh, awesome artwork behind us, too. Uh, we'll show more of that later. Yeah. yeah. So we're going to see what we can see in here, see what we can get. Um, we already know what we're probably getting. Right? We have some ideas. We have some ideas. So, yeah, so Connections Cafe and Eatery at Epcot. And uh, I'm hungry. Me too. Let's go see this place. Did and uh, well, Sarah got our food. I got a table. It's uh, it's yeah. actually fairly crowded in here. I feel horrible when I saw Sarah walking up with all the food. I want to leap into action, but we have a booth. <laughs> so, have a booth. Um, it's a good spot. Yeah, okay. I didn't, didn't know it would be so heavy, and uh, I already apologized. Just looking at the menu right now, so it's going to give descriptions of what we got. So um, I did speak directly to a chef. So it sounds like here at Connections, you can actually talk to a chef versus a lot of quick service. She'll talk to a manager. Um, but because we have so many special dietary needs, it makes sense for us to talk to a manager yeah. or chef versus trying to mobile order just yeah. look on yeah. the menu. So, Chef Chad, chef Chad, awesome, super awesome. And then Sophie, who is the cast member at the register, was also Sophie was good. Yeah, okay, very Sophie helpful. and Chef Chad, awesome. Very helpful. Shout out to them. Yes, yeah, so we got a bunch of stuff. So we're splitting. We're splitting some things today because we are going to go to the festival later. We got the French Pistro Burger. And, and why did we, uh, really quickly, right? Um, this was recommended to us by uh, oh, yeah. by two of our patrons. We got to recently have dinner Allie with Brian. Allie and Brian. Hello. We, we, you recommended yeah, it, awesome. it to us. We had dinner with you. So uh, we're, trying. we're trying it now. But so. we did get it without mushrooms because neither one of us likes mushrooms. We're not allergic to mushrooms. Yeah. We just do not like them. Yes, yeah, so we got the French pizza burger on a gluten-free bun. It's safe for both of us. Um, and then we got allergy. You can get a bunch of different sides. We ended up getting the fries. And they gave us two orders of fries because they did a whole bunch for the allergy order because they have a dedicated fryer just for fries. So we got lots of fries. And then we got the plant-based miswa salad. Who knew? Which does not have cabbage in it because you know Brandon is allergic. Does it normally have cabbage yeah. in it? No. It's like spring green. So it's got some potatoes in it, um, green beans. Looks like it's got a nice kind of light vinaigrette. I'm excited about this. Yeah, this looks, looks really good. good. And then the last thing we got. Sarah because, needs to drink this quick. Yeah, it's, it's going fast. It's melting. So this is the mango coconut. Sorry, I'm looking at my phone for description here. The mango coconut milkshake. It is um, plant based, so this is a vegan dessert. It's dairy free and it is also gluten free. So we did double check with Chef Chad. Cool. And it has a pomegranate molasses drizzle. And I'm curious at what that's awesome. going to taste like. So I'm going to give it a try. I'll give it a try. It is melting, so we're, she's doing this first. That's mango. I like mango. You might, you might need to go get a spoon for this. This is almost like the ice oh, cream. It's, maybe it's not melting. <laughs> it's not. It's been sitting for a while. It's not that melting. Do you want to try it at all? Yeah, we're not. It's safe um, for both of us. Yeah, so we actually, we everything here today. is safe for both of us. We, we haven't had anything today that so. would. As many of you know, we are. A gluten-free household primarily, so it, ooh, that's good, but it's a lot we of don't ice keep cream. a lot of the other allergens in the house, so normally we eat stuff when we're out. It's it might good, look right? like I'm guzzling it, but I'm not. The straw is nasty. We might need to get spoons. I might send you to go get a spoon. I might like be it. a spoon, but yeah, it, it's, it's not good. super it's sweet. Good. I like it. We're gonna get switched back. Okay. All right, so well, let's try some fries. I mean, you can get one of fries. Really quick, everyone. Cheers. Cheers. Fried chicken. They're hot. Really good. Let me just say, I, I love. A little bit of seasoning on it, maybe. I love how everything here is a high quality. Um, it's not plastic. Yeah. These are like real, like, real a, not like a melamine kind of. My, 
if history is an indication, Disney will change that and go cheap um, with the uh, plastic utensils. Like, does everyone remember Satuli Canteen? I don't know. When Satuli Can Canteen first it? opened, and I'm going to stop. Sure. But Disney, presentation's amazing. Please keep it. Please, please, please. If a few people walk out with these, they shouldn't, by the no. way. That's wrong. But if they do, don't punish you us all. Try the Salad first. Wait, burger or salad? This is salad first. All right. There are very green things in there. I'm trying to get a bite, everyone. Oh, yeah, there's like some kind of leaf beans and stuff in here. This looks good. Mmm. Wow, I like it. Okay. Mmm. I use this song in our cruise video. Royalty free music. <laughs> this is really good. There's a what's the sauce or the? It's got like a balsamic in here. You can taste the. Vinegar? It's got vinegar. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Lots of vinegar, but I like that. Mm -hmm. It's definitely got yeah. a very acidic vinegar yeah, punch acidic. to it. Yeah, acidic. There you go. I like it. Those very, very refreshing. Acidic, yeah. Balances out the French fries that we got and the burger. That's really good. I'd get that again. Yeah, we would. The potatoes good. are nice in it. They're nice. It actually tastes like that. It's not a quick service salad. I like it. I'd eat this at a real restaurant. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. That's really good. And again, plant-based, so if you are dairy-free, vegan, vegetarian, that's going to be a nice option. I like that a lot. I like it a lot. We're going to go for more fries. I'm going to try the burger. Now, this is a gluten-free bun, obviously. Mm hmm Mmm. That's really good. Oh, wow. Look oh, that bacon. Yeah, bacon's very nice. Wow. The burger seems like not quite... Like deluxe or three bridges no. quality, but like kind of in between. I like the for a quick service, yeah, not quick, total quick service burger. For a quick service burger, huge step up. Yeah, huge. I just got some of the aioli in there, yep. the Dijon mayonnaise. That's delicious. Wow. All right, breeze nice on it. It's delicious. Um, now I want to try all the burgers here. I do too. Um, I'll joke for real. We're not joking at all, but I'll joke inside. For a quick that's service a, that's at a Disney, very good. it's a step up. Is it as good as a Steakhouse 71 burger? No, we're not. That's not fair to compare. No, but if you're coming so. to Epcot, yep. this is a great option, I think, for quick service. I mean, it's uh, a step yeah. up. Let me have one more bite. And I love how, like, allergy-friendly it is. What's nice, it's like, if you want kind of the burgers and fries style food, you can come here. We've got Regal Eagle for kind of Regal Eagle's awesome stuff, too. Sunshine Seasons. That's pretty good, too. This is good. This is really We're good. We're coming back here again for more burgers. Yes. I want the Southwest burgers. This is really good. Um, we'll do a we'll do a deep freeze for us. This will be a shorter video, mm -hmm. but um, good. I'm impressed. I'm impressed. Good job, Connection Cafe and Eagle. Yeah, and price point. It was two dollars thirty-seven for everything. You got a soda. We got the shake. And we split the burger, and this is definitely more than enough of the salad. And plus, yeah. obviously, we're doing the festival later today. But so we're gonna walk this off. After this. Yeah. <laughs> so, so this was okay. We, this might be our new favorite quick service in Epcot. I don't yeah. know. We gotta come back here. We gotta come back times. at least a couple times. We gotta and, try uh, more of the menu. And Regal Eagle is a fair uh, runner up. Yeah. We're better. I and there's definitely a lot of stuff on the menu that's gluten free friendly stuff for uh, Brandon's allergies. We'll get the chicken tenders next time, but we're sharing a lot of stuff today. Yeah, so we're we sharing. We want to cross contaminate. So yeah, right, we're good so far. No cross contamination. So well, we're gonna enjoy this. And then what, we'll do what did I No cross contamination heat around here no at all. No cross contamination all around we're here. Tough, um, but uh, we're gonna eat this and then we'll do a quick deep breath. Yeah, this um, is awesome. Because we we also have to talk about. The location itself. Oh yeah. We haven't talked about that yet. We'll, we'll yeah. do that in a deep break, but yeah, this is really good. Yeah. Uh, recommended already. Connections Cafe. Oh my gosh. Making Done. connections by the way. Yeah, making connections. Before we jump into our review, our thoughts on our first experience at Connections, um, very quickly, Sarah. Very quickly, okay, I have three shout outs right now. Our friends three. Kelly and Joe from Young at the Parks were here. Yep. Um, they were in Connections Cafe. Give them a check out, they have a YouTube channel. 
Um, They're cool. See. Yeah, and They're then cool and then who? Okay, then we also saw, and I cannot remember her name, but her son's name is Logan, and it's his birthday today. So happy birthday, Logan! Happy birthday, Logan! Fellow celiacs in the house. Yep. So I uh, got to see them right outside of Connections Cafe, which is great to talk to them for. Yeah, a while. they were telling us about Space Two Twenty, which of course we have not been to yet. But if we can get in right now, they're convincing us. We need to go. Um, we need to go so badly. We've been trying, and that's all the story. But then we also, right before we started filming this. It was awesome. We got to meet Rachel and Chris. Yes, that was yep. awesome. Yep. So, More special diets, folks, gluten-free and dairy-free. So that was awesome. Yeah. Just talking about some of the different options here in the park, mm -hmm. the festivals. So it is awesome when we get to meet other special diet yeah. folks out here. And of course, if you see us, say hi. Say hi. If we're filming, you can interrupt yeah. us. Like, if, we're if, not that cool. <laughs> if someone recognized us right now, we're good I mean, we, we are pretty cool. Um, we're building up to those uh, 1 million subscribers. Oh my gosh. I'm just kidding. No, seriously, like yeah, Sarah just said, we've said it. Us, just, just Feel free to say hi at yeah. any time. We don't mind interruptions at, at all. all. We and, would love and, to connect. And we'll talk to you for as long as you want to talk. So um, um, some good conversation know, today. I could. Um, we didn't even touch upon right. Star Wars and movies. And, and we mainly talked about Disney and uh, special diets yeah. and restaurants. So it was incredible. We hope all of them have an amazing day today. Yeah. Because as soon as we're done here, we're heading to the uh, Flower Garden Festival. Yeah, we're going to take a look at the festival. So, um, but Connections Cafe. Move, moving to that now. Yeah, so... Beyond those connections, the Connection mm -hmm. Cafe good connection us with good food. Yeah, it, it's, should we talk about the food first or what we think of the location? Okay, let's, I think let's talk about the food quickly because okay. we did a pretty good, I think, pretty good job inside. Job yeah. inside. Overall, I think this is definitely going to be a top contender for quick, quick service. service. If you have special dietary needs, um, not only do they have a bunch of different options, but we were also able to speak directly to a chef which does not happen that much in quick service restaurants. Yeah. So this was really awesome because um, Chef Chad talked through all the options, really made sure to adjust, modify, uh, and make sure we were all set up. The burger, phenomenal. Burger was really good. We, of course, split it. We, we, we did really well in there with, with our diets because we have a lot more to eat going that way soon. But um, yeah, we split the burger and really good. I uh, It was safe for both of us, of course, yeah. everything on it gluten-free bun and the bun was pretty good too i don't know what yeah what it was, was the, it was the bloomfield farm bloomfield farms one. okay but um yeah burger was good the cheese was really good yeah it was brie, brie. um but brie the salad amazing. funnily enough we both loved the salad loved it this one over here ate almost the entirety of the salad on his own by by the time it was done yeah, yeah. there was very little left of it salad extreme i think sarah said it inside the restaurant it was so flavorful right? it was to me, the the burger was so good. Yeah, the burger felt like a step up from a quick service, but still not a sit down dining burger. Yeah. Yet the salad felt like a sit down dining salad. Yeah, that was a like a table salad. service salad. Um, I would order that salad at a air quote real restaurant. Yeah, so. salad was great. Yeah. Um, super fresh, super light. Uh, I would definitely recommend that one. Yeah. And the mango uh, coconut smoothie that I got was so good. Yeah, she finished that whole thing. That was she down there. Yeah, so that was delicious. Yeah. I would definitely recommend that. And we're excited to go back. So we'll Very definitely excited. do another review of that and try some different options. Yeah. Um, All right, now theme. Let's theme, uh, well, hold on. Let's say the positives. I love that mural. The murals Which inside are amazing. we probably actually didn't get enough photos and video of, but whatever we got, Sarah's inserted it. By this point, by the time you see this, or she'll put it over this, you'll see it. But the mural is awesome. Other than that, it looks like an airport. Place. Yeah, that's what I was like, is this yeah. an airport food court? Yeah, or a high school food court or a college food court or, or something. Mall. Does oh. anybody go to the mall anymore? Stranger Things goes yeah. to the mall, everyone. It was <laughs> just, I think it's very generic. Yeah, it's a generic theming, minus minus the murals. Although the murals very are open, awesome. very spacious, yep. lots of seating, yeah, which let, is great. Yeah, let's talk about that. I think out of, I'm trying to say, is it, yeah, out of every Disney dining location, quick service oh, on that's all property, this is the yeah, most that you're going, you will have no issues finding a seat. I mean, we're here on a Saturday and had no issues finding yeah, a seat. Yeah, I agree. So, very, very cool. Um, the theming in terms of minus the murals is just very plain. To me, it didn't feel like Epcot. It didn't, but it is what it is. Food was awesome. Um, ample seating and the murals are great. Yeah. So, I think with that, we will recommend Connections going to Connections Cafe. Cafe. Yeah. Highly recommended and we will be back. Yeah, we'll be back. We can't wait to check it out. So, other than that. Other than that. That's it. That's it. Thank you to all the patrons on Patreon. Everyone's amazing. Thank you to all our subscribers. Uh, like, thumbs up, hit the bell, everything. And with that, we will see you and connect with you real soon. Bye. Bye.